Hello guys, Rachel here of Archaeologist Gaming. Today, we can do the short unboxing and also reviewing the Thermaltake Pacific MX2 Ultra Water Block. Let's do the unboxing! Inside the box, you will find the brackets, screws, cable, and thermal paste, the user's manuals, the warranty paper, and lastly, the Thermaltake Pacific MX2 Ultra Water Block. Let's go to specifications and features! The Pacific MX2 Ultra has dimensions of 92 by 92.5 by 64 millimeters. The materials used for the MX2 Ultra are copper, PMMA, and ABS. This is an ultra water block from Thermaltake, which means it has IPS LCD display with a resolution of 480 by 480 pixels. At the side, you will find a USB port that can be connected to your motherboard through a USB to 9 pin connector. The base plate is made from copper with a nickel finish. The water block has a pre installed bracket for Intel. You can also move the screws for the brackets for compatibility for LGA1700 or the older sockets. The MX2 Ultra also has an AMD bracket. It is easy to replace the brackets. Just follow the instructions in the user's manual and you can never go wrong. Let's disassemble the water block. One of the features of this water block is the central inlet design, which makes a better water flow. But because of this design, the inlets and outlets are restricted to a specific direction. The inlet is on the right and the outlet is on the left. Also, one of the features of this water block is the built-in temperature sensor to monitor the temperature of the coolant passing through. For the test bench, I will use the Thermaltake Pacific C240 DDC soft tube water cooling kit. See the description for the complete specs of the kit. For the CPU, I will use the Ryzen 5 5600X, an Aorus B550 Pro AX motherboard with a 16GB T-Force Delta RGB and Power Color Fighter RX C6600. For the fans, I will use two SWA Fans 12. Let's assemble the water block. Before we go to the benchmark results, let's talk another feature of the MX2 Ultra. As the MX2 Ultra has an LCD display, it means you can display anything here using the TTRGB Plus software. You can show the temps, usage, frequencies, weather, and also time. But what I really like the most is that you can put a GIF or image in the display to customize your block to the fullest. Here are my final thoughts. The Thermaltake Pacific MX2 Ultra is a premium water block. You can show the real you through the customizations of the LCD display. The water block itself performs well for now, compared to the Pacific W4 water block. We can verify this further when we can test a lot more of water blocks. I will repeat, this is a premium water block, so which means it comes with a premium price. Though the features are great, it will still up to you if it's worth the buy, because of its LCD display and other features. You can buy the Thermaltake Pacific MX2 Ultra Water Block around the price of $179.99 or 10,500 pesos at the time of recording and exchange rate at your nearest Thermaltake affiliated stores. I hope this video is informational for you. For more videos, click on the subscribe button and follow my Facebook page. And see you in the next video.